Today we're going to review the Glendronic 18 year old Scotch whiskey. All right, let's have a look at the box for a bit. It's a nice blue box. Uh, what does it say here? The Glendronic Allardyce 18 year old exclusively matured in the finest Spanish Oloroso sherry casks. It's a Highland single malt Scotch whiskey. It says on the box, non chill filtered and natural color. That's awesome. That's really good. 46% alcohol by volume. This body is very interesting because what's, what the rumors are saying is that there is older juice in this bottle, older than 18 years old. Now the reason for that is the distillery closed down in 2000, around the 2000 era, and they ran out of the 18 year old juice. So they've had to take juice from older casks, which has been aged and matured longer, uh, to put in their 18 year old bottles. So that is the rumors. And if you can just see by how dark that liquid is in there, it could be true. To find when your bottle was bottled, just look on the back and there should be a date on the back of the bottle, right here. So this bottle was bottled in 24th of April, 2018. Let's give this one a pour. All right, here we go. Wow. Nice quick pour. Yeah. Look at the color of the Glendronic 18 year old. It's quite a dark color. Let's give it a nice swirl. Let's get onto the nose. Ooh, it's rich. Perfumey, it's sweet, S sort of uh, sultana kind of raisin notes in the nose. Almost cognac-like smell to it as well. Let's go have a taste of this one. It's rich, it's a little bit spicy, but the spice only hits you at the front and it doesn't really last that long into the finish. The, the roasted fruits or the baked fruits go all the way from the start to the finish quite pleasant. It's, it's really, really pleasant actually. Um, let's go for a second taste. Mm. <clears throat> so when the Glendronic goes into your mouth, it hits you straight away with those baked um, roasted fruits. And that goes away all the way to the finish. But once it hits the finish, it slows down and it kind of drops off very quickly. So the finish doesn't last as long. But it's definitely a lot of flavor on the arrival of the whiskey once it enters the mouth and all the way through. And get some some black plums in the in the taste as well, and some sultanas or raisins. I wish the finish lasted a bit longer. That would have made the whiskey a lot better tasting. Uh, you get a lot of the initial hit of the taste up front, um, and then it goes through. 
all the way up to the finish and it quickly drops from there. So this is a Glendronic 2018 bottling. If the rumors are true, the juice inside here is 22 to 23 years old. If you look at the color of the juice inside, it's fairly dark and it actually does look like a 22, 23 year old sherried whiskey. And that's pretty exciting. If you can find one that is bottled around 2017, 18 or 19, you're getting really, really old juice if the rumors are true. So that's really good bang for your buck. Now in terms of ratings, I'm gonna give the Glendronic 18 year old a solid 85 out of 100. There you go guys, the Glendronic 18 year old. If you've ever had it before, let me know in the comments below what you thought of this bottle. If you've had an older version of it, or if you've had one of the uh, 2017, 18 or 19 year olds, which is rumored to have the old juice in it, let me know how that tastes as well, so I can compare it to my bottle. Anyway, cheers guys, thank you for watching.